Hey guys, welcome to Blue Note, and Blue Note is about timeless noted messages. So if these messages resonate with you, please like, share, subscribe to help my channel grow and to help these messages get out to someone who needs these messages. The time is 10.02 a.m., May 24th, 2022. Um, as you can see, I have my plant, my succulent plant that I've been growing um i've been growing this i've been i propagated this plant a year ago and i just wanted to share it with you guys because um um it, it's about growth it's about patience and growth at this time i just feel like um this message today may have something to do with some type of patience or growth or some type of sprouting energy but i've been propagate i've been I've been very patient with this plant. It took me a whole year for me to get to this um position right now, okay? It took me a whole year for it to sprout like this, and I'm just really proud of my plant. And I just wanted to share it with you guys because I'm all about growth, and I'm happy about growth. Um, I have a whole bunch of these, okay? They really make me happy. But um, the time is 10.03 a.m., and... um. The song that I got for you guys is um, I'm With You by Avril Lavigne. And the part that I got is um, It's a damn cold night Trying to figure out this life Won't you take me by the hand Take me somewhere new Don't know who you are But I'm I'm with you. So um, I'm I'm strongly getting somebody is might be in this uh, transforming energy, maybe changing. Um, I feel like somebody is trying to figure out life right now. Maybe someone is always. Um, I feel like somebody's always guiding you, or somebody's always trying to take you by the hand and take you in these different places. Uh, maybe like a family member or a sibling or your friends may be trying to take you on different paths and you probably don't want to go these paths. They're not for you. I feel like you're ready to be on your own or maybe make decisions on your own. Maybe leave or relocate somewhere else or just leave a situation or leave friendship situations or just leave things that just no longer serve you. Um, I feel like somebody, someone is probably just moving not like it don't even have to be like relocate and move and i just feel like somebody is shifting somebody is changing somebody is moving somebody's probably going another way okay figuring out life okay on their own without anybody in their ear somebody's you no know, without somebody telling telling them what to do what they should be doing somebody is ready to walk their own path literally I'm, my ears, my both of my ears is ringing right now. So that is a confirmation. Somebody is ready for growth. Somebody is ready for walking on walking on their own path, leaving familiar situations and people who no longer serve you or serve your highest good. A fucking transformation. Okay, this is all about change, growth, and patience. Transformation. Um, I, I'm I'm getting the energy of a caterpillar. Growing into a butterfly, somebody is ready to fly off the nest. Somebody is ready to fly off and explore. Not ex yeah, explore other options, explore other opportunities. I feel like somebody is feeling delayed. I feel like um people are holding this person back for their own beneficial gain, or holding this person back to make themselves feel better. Holding this person back because this holding on. I'm I'm getting a crabs in a barrel type of energy, like somebody has people holding on to their damn leg and they're damn near out their fucking barrel, okay? Somebody is all somebody is damn they're nearly there. They're getting the fuck out of here, okay? 1006 AM, May 24th, 2022. So your overall energy, you got expectation clarified with the four of cups in reverse, followed by the six of cups in reverse. So I feel like in this energy, I feel like with this expectation, I'm getting this energy that somebody is keeping tabs on somebody. Number 28 can be very significant. Somebody is keeping tabs on, on somebody, watching and stalking them, um, observing them from afar, probably looking for a sign and looking at things in all perspectives, basically hoping, um, expecting someone, okay? Um, yeah, somebody is definitely keeping tabs on somebody, waiting for something. They're they're hoping for something. Clarify with the four cups in reverse. Um, 
whoever this is that you're watching or keeping tabs on on or you're watching and stalking this person whoever it is you're you're very interested in them okay and you're aware of it and you are definitely in this energy of focusing on this person you're focused on somebody who you're interested in you're aware that you are interested in them you you're not hiding that you're interested in them. You definitely want to take an opportunity with this person. Whoever it is, it's probably somebody from your past. Clarify, follow by with this Six of Cups. Um, you're watching this person who you're interested in growing up and maturing. Or this is your energy actually watching yourself growing up and mature it could be vice versa or somebody else is watching you but i feel like this is your energy literally watching somebody who you want to take an opportunity with who you're interested in you're focused on this person you're aware that you want to be with this person you want to take an opportunity with this person you're seeing that they're growing up and mature and you want to let go of you i feel like you want to let go of your past Again, this is somebody who wants to go their own pathway and their own pathway pertains to somebody who they are watching. And it could be maybe a childhood friend who they want a reunion with, somebody who they probably is or probably this is probably somebody who you want to protect and support. Um, this could be a childhood friend who you definitely want a reunion with. You have a lot of childhood memories with this person. This person is probably an influencer or they have past life influences with your life. You are definitely wearing rose tinted glasses on with this person. You are probably in love with this person, okay? Um, you're watching this person grow up and mature. Um, this is probably somebody who you had a relationship with, somebody who you may have had a sexual connection with, with the rose tinted glasses on you. You're definitely fond of this person. You're really focused on this person. Um, you probably look at this person as your soulmate. Um, this is probably somebody who you feel like you want to have a, a relationship with. You're definitely holding on to this person, okay? Um, there's some type of energy of, um, the holding on energy is definitely, um, very kind of like possessive type of energy. You may feel like this person kind of like, I'm getting this energy. You pay, you may feel like this person belonged to you, or you may feel like you guys belong with each other, but I feel like you in this energy of taking this opportunity, you want to let go of the regret. You want to let go of anybody from your past because in this followed by, I just feel like you are having like sleepless nights about this person. Number 32 can be significant. I feel like you having sleepless nights about this person. You're having nightmares. You may be under extreme pressure right now because I feel like you in this energy of letting go of the past. You're ready to go your own pathway. I just feel like you're really kind of nervous of going this pathway, but you're not. I feel like you're probably crying a lot or you're probably in your feelings. You're probably stressed. You're having sleepless nights. You're in sleepless nights. You're in despair because I feel like with this bad health, I feel like you're kind of like defeated in this energy. It's it's like you no longer can um hold on to this fear. Um, you cannot hold on to being nervous and worried about going this other pathway. Here we go with pathway. You're no longer. I just feel like you're defeated. It's it's like you are. You're aware that you are kind of like no longer worry about taking this opportunity of taking this other pathway with towards this person or towards this life or this pathway that you want to take you're actually in this energy of transforming right now again i said that already i said you're going through a transformation a caterpillar growing into a butterfly somebody is changing and this is a beautiful change you're walking right into the light okay these butterflies is transformation you're walking to the pathway of light so you're going the right pathway and while you're going this other pathway you are thinking about somebody who you have fond memories with whoever this is you this is the person who you are interested in you are focused on this person okay you are taking the opportunity with this person and you basically are completing a cycle probably with another situation or you're completing a cycle with um a dear a, a, another a pathway that's no longer serving you at all you're leaving unfamiliar you you're not unfamiliar yeah basically unfamiliar the situation that you may be in right now that you're trying to walk away from is probably unfamiliar to you in a way because 
you may be in this energy of basically t growing into a butterfly. You're you're transforming into someone else, which is a good thing. This is you're you're following your you're following your calling. You're following your path. You're following your highest good. And I feel like people are a little bothered by that. Um, I also feel like you are in this energy of going another pathway towards somebody in secret. This may be a secret that you you may be trying to keep this. Um, this new pathway, a secret, um, I feel like you are definitely coming to somebody's home and probably telling them how you feel about them. Whoever this is that you are going towards, this could be somebody who could be a business owner or somebody who has a new job. Whoever this is, is somebody who is um, following their calling at this time and they probably have... Um, this is somebody who is heading to great fortune. They're going through a cycle change as well. So I feel like you are heading towards somebody who is going through a cycle change as well as you. You are probably right behind this person or you're following behind with this person. You you want to take this pathway towards this person, basically. Both of my ears is ringing right now. Um, they're burnt. My, the top of my ears is burning right now as well. So this is actually a confirmation for you um to take this pathway because this pathway is actually leading you to the the light is leading you to follow your calling at this time okay the time is 11 this might be a twin flame who you are going towards i feel like you have learned some type of karmic lesson or you did or you you completed some type of karmic debt and you're ready to get out of that barrel and go into this uh, this new pathway that you are going towards, okay? That that song was actually perfect this morning. I was like, why am I getting this song? I haven't heard this song since probably freaking college. I, I haven't even listened to that song until like... I, I, I used to listen to it in high school, but I, I haven't listened to that song in so long. I was just surprised that that song actually came up. That may be somebody's favorite song or somebody is definitely going through this type of energy. It's like a perfect song, okay? Um, it's Six of Cups in reverse. Again, somebody is letting go of the past. Um, they may have been in this energy of being stuck in the past. And I feel like the only reason why that somebody probably was stuck in these familiar situations is because of other people other people who probably need to grow up other people who really is trying to hold you back okay you're letting go of the past and you are in this energy followed by with the seven of wands you are defending yourself um you're protecting yourself you're standing up for yourself you're being very defensive in this energy because i feel like you may be under attack from somebody who is trying to hold you back from moving forward and not only are they just trying to hold you back from moving forward forward this is probably other this is several people who is who's trying to hold you back in this um comfortable state that they are in somebody is trying to get away from these people because i feel like at this time it, it may have been it may be like a lot of friends that may be trying to hold you back you may have thought that this is like some type of energy where people um just just being a friend i just no i just feel like you you're un, you feel like you're under attack because these people want you to stay in some type of low vibrational state but it's looking like you're sitting up higher than these people you don't even see these people that's actually throwing these daggers you may have thought these people were your friends but these people actually probably want to keep you down and you're standing up for yourself right now you're showing that you have a backbone you're protecting yourself and you're being very defensive in this energy because followed by with this ace of wands you have some you have an enlightenment right now that you want to start a new beginning you want a new beginning you want growth and excitement i just feel like you have some type of creative spark in your life you may have a spark about who you want to actually move forward to you have a spark with somebody who is lighting up your fucking flame okay whoever that you want to have this new beginning with you are so interested in this person you are focused on this person you're definitely going to be taking the opportunity with this person this is definitely some good news for you okay followed by with the seven of pentacles and the fool i just feel like you're manifesting you're manifesting your new beginning i feel like you have been manifesting your new beginning you're probably working on your finances you're probably manifesting your goals planning your dreams planning your inheritance right now you're probably looking at the hard work that you have been working on paying off you're seeing your rewards you're manifesting this new beginning and you are taking a leap of faith you are freeing yourself from things that no longer serve you and you may feel like this is a foolish um young-minded type of energy it's not it's something that's new 
new. It's growth. It's excitement. This is something that's basically going to transform you and help you change. Turning a caterpillar growing into a butterfly. It may be something different. My ears is ringing again. Um, this is a message for somebody to take that leap of faith into new beginnings, into their new life, okay? Um, clarify with this five of wands in reverse. I just feel like you just, you just end in the conflict period, period. You're ending the conflict of people holding you back. You're no longer going to be staying in this energy of fake fake friendships or fake love or or people who's trying to hold you back from your pathway you're ready to move that other pathway and this is your it this is your sign of taking that opportunity and this is your sign to actually go ahead and follow your heart and um make a decision from your heart for giving this rom this romantic offer to somebody you may be trying to um whoever you are Thinking about who you are taking the opportunity with, who you're interested in, you're probably going to be calling this person or taking the opportunity to ask this person out to probably have drinks. You're going to be offering them an invitation to go out, okay? I just get this energy that you may be like in it. You, you may be in this energy. You may be obsessed with this person. There may be like a strong bondage that you have towards this person. Cancer Scorpio energy. Um... And it's overall energy. Um, you're definitely, um, whoever this is, is somebody who you want a relationship with. Y'all have a strong connection with. You're definitely still holding on to this person. You're still focused on this person, okay? Um, 10, 18 a.m. on the clock, May 24th, 2022. At this present time, um, you have a mature man. This mature man, this is de this number five. This is a higher font. This is somebody who is... A guru or a teacher, you may be somebody who is probably like a spiritual leader or a spiritual teacher or just somebody who is a very strong influencer at this time. You may be in a... You may be in some type of commitment or you're very committed to being in being an influencer, but I feel like you're in this energy of really pondering and thinking right now. You're, pro you're probably at home thinking about moving forward into your, your new pathway but i feel like you have this on and off type of energy um you don't want to be bound to a situation anymore you don't want to be committed to some type of situation anymore you want to do what you want to do you want to go in your own style you want to get out of a situation this is why you have this on and off light right here i feel like you're growing and maturing and old situations old familiar situations is just not cutting it for you anymore you don't want it anymore okay uh taurus gemini energy um this old familiar situation could be pertaining to somebody who who you definitely have doubts about. You're holding back from this person. This could be somebody or this could just be several people. Um, whoever this is that you're holding back from, this is somebody who has a lack of confidence. They have low self-esteem. They're very, this is a very weak individual. And what I'm getting from this, from going back from the overall energy, I feel like this person is maybe intimidated by you moving forward and going in your other pathway and i feel like this is one of the peoples that's actually trying to hold you back because they have low self-esteem they don't have the inner strength or the confidence to move forward they're really trying to hold you back but i feel like you're holding back from this person again this is somebody who probably don't they, they're probably not on the same path as you and you may have figured that out and this is actually probably you trying to set boundaries in this energy you're expressing yourself and communicating to this person um of these boundaries that you're setting with this person and this person is feeling very intimidated by it okay somebody is feeling very um a little vulnerable in this energy they lack confidence of the situation they have low self-esteem by the situation but honestly this is probably just really don't have nothing to do with you okay Whoever this is, is really holding on to you. Um, but you, I just feel like you in this energy of being very unhappy. You're in despair because I feel like you're thinking about somebody else or you're thinking about another pathway we want to take. You don't have no inspiration of keeping this going. Um, there is no kind of energy where you're, you're, 
there is no kind of spark in this energy. You, you, you're, you're basically focusing on a negative of this connection or you're focusing on a negative of this old pathway that you are on. You're really bored in this energy. And this is why you're very fickle in this energy. It's like, do I want to stay in this boring ass situation? And it's not, it's not getting me where I need to go. Do I want to stay in a situation that's going to constantly keep me in despair or keep me unhappy? I'm, I'm not at my peace. I'm, I'm basically discontent. I do not want to heal this connection um i basically want to get into my spirituality but i feel like my intuition is blocked by dealing with these people um i just feel like you in this energy of realizing the people that who you are around is actually keeping you stuck stuck in the past stuck in some type of low vibrational energy and you're ready to fly off into the winds you do not want to be with who this is 22 one o'clock um, again, with this two of wands, you are definitely in this energy of you have two paths to take. You have a decision to make. You have options. You're planning your decision. You're definitely in this energy of moving forward and you're taking this, this risk. You're taking this opportunity to move forward and let go of the past. Okay. You are basically withdrawing from these people. You are definitely probably in this energy of waiting. You, you, I'm, I'm getting this energy where you're probably like this. Um, you're, you're trying to be a gentleman. You're, you're very mature. You're trying to be nice towards these people. You may be trying to ease your way off from these people in a nice way, but I feel like, I feel like eventually you're just going to probably just suddenly leave anyway because you know for sure that the grass is greener on the other side by taking this other this this new pathway, okay? You're going another pathway into the light. You're going another pathway. You're transforming and changing at this time. Whoever you're dealing with, this is somebody who is probably addicted to you. Um they may be obsessed with you. Um Again, uh, I just with this strength card in reverse, this person probably don't. They're they're really vulnerable. Whoever this is is very weak. They may have some type of mental health issue, or they have some type of. It don't even have to be a mental health issue. It could be just people having a dependency on you. Whereas though, if you're not around, these people are really going the fuck crazy. If you showing them that you're definitely letting go and, and growing up and maturing, these people are running off like a missing chicken head. I just feel like you may be talking to a bunch of chicken heads or you may be talking to a bunch of people who really just have blocked intuition. You're bored of being around your circle. You're bored of being around people who don't have the same knowledge as you. You're bored around people who just don't want to grow in life, okay? You're really bored of this type of energy and you're ready, to, you're ready to move forward, okay? Because here we are. You're in love with someone else or you're, you're in love. You're in love with maybe your soulmate. You're in love with somebody who you want a relationship with, somebody who you want some type of sexual connection with. You feel like this person is your perfect union, okay? I'm going to pull another one. Yeah, okay? You want renewal and balance with this person, okay? You see nothing but peace with this person. You want to take a leap of faith with this person. You want balance and peace with whoever this is that you want to move forward with, okay? You look at this person as your muse. You're very content in this energy. You want to heal uh, um, heal some type of lover's energy with somebody. You want to get into your spirituality. Whoever this is that you are probably very interested in this is somebody who is in their spirituality somebody who is healing um somebody who probably could be a healer you want a renewal with this person you're interested and you're focused on this person okay um you are definitely taking a risk and taking a leap of faith with this person okay um taurus leo aries energy um in this present time, I just feel like you have made a decision. You have made a decision to move forward with your life. And you no longer is letting anybody or anyone hold you back anymore. Because if I just feel like I'm getting really hot right now. I just feel like whoever this is, is somebody who, who, who is like, like literally trying to dig their claws in you. And you are really trying to free yourself and detach yourself from this person or detach yourself from this community. You want your power back. You want your independence back. You're going through some type of, you're overcoming addictions at this time. You're overcoming people with addictions. You're overcoming this shit because whatever you're surrounded by, 
my ears is burning right now i feel like you are fucking bored of it you're tired of it you're tired of being around these people i don't feel like nobody is really holding you back but they want you to stay in this low vibrational situation or this energy that no longer fucking serve you okay um taurus gemini leo aries energy um number five eight two can be very significant which equals to 15 and that is the devil card these people are addicted and obsessed with you and it's actually not in a good way this is it, this is basically abuse this is why you're you're in this energy of standing up for yourself and protecting yourself because you are under some type of attack somebody is really trying to dig their claws in you and you are showing that you have a backbone um, whoever this is have some type of dependency towards your energy. Um, I, I feel like this person probably don't have a sense of self. Whoever this is, this could be one person. This could be several people. Whoever this is, is more so intimidated because you're growing and that's really pathetic. Okay. Whoever that is, is mad because you are going another pathway and you made a decision to go another pathway. But that is you guys reading. Um, I did pull a meditation quote for you guys, and it says, In any given moment, we have two options to step forward into growth or to step into that step back into safety. Okay? You're growing. Caterpillar growing into a butterfly. You're changing. You're transforming. And nobody can stop you at this time because I feel like you are taking this opportunity and you're focused on your awareness of this opportunity. You're aware of what you want to do. Nobody can change your mind. It's time for you to take that step forward into your journey, into your journey, into following your calling, transforming and changing and follow and following your calling. Fuck what everybody have to say. Fuck what anybody fucking have to say. They can go kick fucking rocks and go find their own fucking life. They need to get the fuck on. For real, for real. Okay? But I love you guys. This is all I got for you guys. Um, Again, this is Blue Note. This is Timeless Note and Messages. If these, if these messages resonate with you, please like, share, subscribe to help my channel grow. And to help these messages get out to someone who needs these messages. Because I feel like this is somebody who's going through some type of spiritual growth or spiritual awakening at this time. Somebody has awakened. They know where they want to go. They know their life purpose. They know they're following their life's journey. And I'm all for that. I'm all for growth. I'm so excited for you guys. My, I have chills. I'm, I'm really excited for you guys. And I'm really happy for you guys. Okay? I love you guys. Smooches.